So, I popped to Winscombe, which has got my favourite charity shop, the RSPCA. Um, there are actually only two charity shops in the whole little... Well, it's only a village. It's only a village. It's a tiny little village. But the people in that one are lovely, and I always come and see them if I can, and I always find good bargains. So, I'm going to sneak and have a little cream tea and then after that I'll be coming back to you with my try on. So now we're on to Winscombe and Winscombe only has two shops. Um, one's a bit rarefied so I very rarely find anything there but my favourite, the RSPCA, I always find something. This is going to be a little bit different because the things that I found this time are not in my normal style at all. They're very, very different. You'll see. Tell me what you think. I'd be interested to know. So in Asia, all the women wear sort of big baggy sort of Laura Ashley style nighty dresses um, from the sort of 1970s because it's very 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 fashionable sorry my puppy's having a little old whinge and um, so I found this dress which is actually by George and um, I added a little skirt underneath this is a four pound skirt this is a five pound dress um, it's got lovely details on it, some nice little cotton lace work, it's got strings, it's got lovely big pockets. Um, this is absolutely what the Asian women are wearing at the moment. I added the shirt over the top because I thought it gave it a sort of another layered effect, but I will take it off and show you the full dress. Now, my husband really doesn't like this. This is not the kind of thing he likes. But other people have said, oh, that looks really nice. So I'm going to show you anyway. Tell me what you think. Do you like the whole sort of 70s um, holly hobby look? Very romantic, girly sort of clothes that look a bit much, a bit like your grandma's nighty, Or do you think it's yuck? So anyway, there's your first outfit from Winscombe RSPCA. This is five pounds for the jacket, which is a next one. Five pounds for the dress and four pounds for the skirt. Staying with our green theme, this is a Primark um, little shorty dress with little dots on it. It's very cute, it's quite see-through. Um, I put a long dangly necklace. It's a little too tight for me. I think this would be going straight into my vintage shop because it doesn't really want to go across my bust. But I did think it was cute. I thought it was worth a try. I thought it would work. As, so like if you've got a skirt, it's quite cool to have a couple of different tops to wear with it. But I don't think this one, unfortunately, really works for me. I love this. I think this is really cool, this next jacket. 
I think that could go over many, many different outfits. I think it would probably look good over black as well. Um, it's, it's got a quite a nice lift effect to it. Um, but this is a no. This is a no. We have to have no's. Let me show you the, the whole thing. Um, it's got a really cute little neckline, but unfortunately it's a neckline designed for somebody quite a few sizes smaller than me. Um, and this is not it. So here we go. So this one is going on to Vinted. Anybody looking for a bargain? It's very, very cute. Very cute indeed. Okay, so our final outfit is different again. Um, I'll come back and show you that one. This shop is always worth a visit. If you live anywhere in that Somerset area and you can get down to um, Winscombe, go and see the lovely people at the RSPCA. Um, if you've got anything you want to donate, they're always looking for donations. They're one of the few places where they haven't got a sign up all the time going, we don't take donations. They do. Go see them. Um, their jewellery is all for a pound. They have some lovely bits and pieces if you take the time to dig through. There is so much that you do have to dig. But I love that. I love digging through stuff. So go and have a dig through. Go and have a look at their clothes. They've got all the sizes. It's absolutely worth the visit. Absolutely worth the visit. Um, and there's another one over the road. So you've got two to go to. Have a look have a day out and the two really fantastic cafes in fact I think there's more than two, but there's two really lovely cafes there that both do cream teas you will see my little cream tea delicious I highly recommend it that's the strawberry line cafe and who can say no to a cream tea number three coming up I've been trying to find a time when it wasn't quite so windy to do this but unfortunately it's blustery as can be so blustery you have to have um, so we're keeping in the sort of romantic style um, this is per uno which you know I absolutely love completely out of my comfort zone it's pale soft colors little floral prints not at all what I would normally go for but you know what I really really like it I've chucked my linen coat over because you know we're getting a bit chillier now and I put the linen skirt underneath to take it right the way down sort of give it an Edwardian sort of feel but this dress is beyond cute it's really a sweet little dress it's got um, a little self pattern of dots in it it's got little paisley patterns of flowers all over it buttons all the way down um, I've put on the lovely necklace that I found in Cheddar last year um, picks out the greys and the pinks so romantic I put on really rom oh I put two earrings in the same hole that's good <laughs> that's what happens when you're changing in a hurry <laughs> oh, how on earth did I even get two in the same oh there we go I put on very romantic earrings in the same hole <laughs> only me do you know I can't even remember where I found these but I think that they, uh, the little pearls with this little dress are absolutely spot on. Um, I like it. I think it's cute. I think it's very girly, very, I feel feminine in it, which is quite unusual for me. Um, I feel very feminine and girly in it, but I like it. It's not too much. It's not too pink. It's not too beige. It's not too anything. It's just really cute. So I sort of did a sort of 40s do with the hair to give it that feel of retro. What do you think? Did I do well in Winscombe? Not the kind of thing I normally choose. Sometimes I try and push myself to go for things I wouldn't normally choose. And this was definitely a visit where I picked out things that were very, very different. Sorry about the weather did my best. I hope you've enjoyed this try on. This was a five pound dress at the RSPCA in Winscombe. Please go visit them. When you do, say then Crafty Nena sent you. They're very fond of me and I'm very fond of them. <laughs> I'll see you again soon with I think I've got quite a big haul for next time. Wait and see.